Hello guys, this is going to be a few tests showcasing how fast a solid state drive would allow you to access windows from a cold boot, also access windows with a bunch of startup programs initiating and launching simultaneously as windows launches itself. Also, I'm going to be running a simple shutdown test to show you basically how fast your computer can shut down. Basically what this is all doing is it's just showing you how fast the solid state drive can gather the information and then transfer it towards the rest of the components on your computer essentially resulted in a much more snappier responsive and faster system overall because basically your computer is really only as fast as the storage device the storage device holds all the information for you to actually operate and utilize an operating system and utilize the programs and other functions of the operating system so if the storage device is slow in terms of transferring data back and forth your whole computer is going to suffer as a result so i believe that the solid state drive is by far the biggest upgrade that you can get for your computer so what i'm going to do here is going to try to uh press the start button on this application and the power button on my desktop at the same exact time so you guys can roughly see how fast the uh, boot up is also forgot the actual boot up of windows the actual gathering of the information and, the, and executing the process and it all starts as soon as you see that started windows um animation anything previous to that is all bios related and that pretty much varies between other motherboards and bioses and all that other stuff so let's do this right here. All right, I'm gonna bring this up to the monitor. So it takes about 12 seconds for my computer to get past the BIOS post and splash screen. Twenty-two seconds, my computer has booted into Windows, and then within twenty-six seconds. I already just I just put one application which was um, Firefox and it basically it simulates the most um, launch so I'm just gonna stop this here and basically this launched in 26 seconds or it basically launched in uh, 14 seconds because that's when Windows was actually being booted up when you saw the starting windows so any the 12 seconds before that which is all BIOS related so the reason why I even I launched this this was like a, a more simulated and average approach because this basically the an internet browser is by far the most um, launched application when someone boots in the windows because they usually just check their emails and stuff like that so essentially and overall it takes 26 seconds from a cold boot not standby or anything else you just came home or whatever you just turn your computer on and within 26 seconds you're online browsing for your emails and checking your documents or anything of that sort so now what are we going to do here this is going to be just a simple uh, shutdown test. So it closes here. And what we're going to do is we set this over here. I'm going to uh, pretty much showcase how fast your computer can basically uh, shut down. So what I'm going to do here is try to, uh, as soon as I click the start button, I mean, I click the mouse button on the, um, the button on the mouse. I'm going to hit the start button on this application to show you how fast it takes to uh, shut down. It takes you about 10 seconds to shut down the computer, which is very fast, even though that really isn't a significant uh, improvement or anything, because usually when you shut down your computer, you pretty much you leave it alone and you go about your business and the computer eventually shuts down so now what I'm gonna do is in the next test I'm gonna show you how fast I can boot into Windows with a bunch of various programs launching simultaneously at once alright here we are at the test that is going to showcase how fast my computer can boot into Windows with a bunch of various programs launch it simultaneously while Windows loads up its core files and drivers and various things like that. I'll show you guys close up here and what particular programs are going to be launching. So this is pretty much a very unrealistic test because 
really not many people or anyone really is gonna have this many programs launching simultaneously while they're Windows Store. Maybe in a workstation environment, yeah, they have a bunch of very productivity tools that launch simultaneously while the operating system boots. But really, in your average um, real-world user, not many people are really going to have this many programs launching simultaneously while their Windows boots up. So basically, I have the, uh, the stopwatch application down there. I'm going to hit the start button right after I restart my computer and I hear the post beep of my desktop, which signifies that the motherboard has scanned all the components and everything's working A-OK. -okay. All right, so let's start right now. So from about 10 and a half seconds up, that's when Windows begins booting. And I think we're pretty much done at about 39 seconds. So at about 39 seconds, it pretty much every, all of those programs that I showed you guys have fully booted up and they're ready to be used. Which to me is pretty much spectacular. Like to, <laughs> to pretty much have all those programs boot up and they're ready to use within 39 seconds of booting up your computer is pretty much spectacular to me because most people's computers don't even boot up within 39 seconds and just not even have a program launch as well. So let's close all these programs. This is going to take a while. Alrighty, and we pretty much closed all the programs here, so yeah, this really gives you a rough idea of the potential unlock your computer will um, see when you upgrade to a solid state drive. So if you guys have any questions or comments, feel free to um, post them in the comment box, try to answer them to the best of my ability. Thanks for watching this video guys, later.